All right, today, I just want to talk about my best Shopify apps that I like using. And if you're new to this, especially if you're doing drop shipping, I think this would be very helpful for you. Look at that right there. This is one of them. This one right here. This app will help you be able to do drop shipping very easily, uh, importing your products from AliExpress. So if you're new to this, get this app right here. It's free now. It used to cost, but it's free now. So you want to try to get the best free ones. This right here is a um, app that you need if you want to add the sales channel, Pinterest, so people could buy your products off of Pinterest. So if you're doing anything on Pinterest, you need to install this one as well so you can have your uh, sales channel on there through Shopify on Pinterest. Another good one is this app right here. You can collect emails and it's pretty simple. It's pretty simple what you can do. A way to capture those high quality leads and convert them into paying customers. That's what Privy is all about. Privy. See how simple it is? It's really simple to set up, man. So simple. So, and it works with MailChimp. Oh, and that's another one. MailChimp is free. Um, this right here, don't worry about that. That is when you have a lot of email subscriptions. So, I mean, the learning curve is so crazy on here. There's so much stuff you need to learn. If you don't know anything about MailChimp, then you're going to have to go learn about MailChimp. So, but I just want to give you the apps that you, you know, should be checking for. This one right here, it costs money. But if you're doing the uh, free plus shipping method, um, this is one of them right here that you will need. It's not very user friendly. I don't do the free plus shipping method anymore. But if you're going to do that, you need Men Maxify. You're going to need this app right here. This one right here. I like this sales pop one. It's free as well. So like when somebody buys something, let me go here. You see right here, this will keep popping up throughout your website. So when somebody comes there and they'll see, it's like a social proof, you know? Someone in San Francisco purchased a man dry, stretched, long sleeve sweatshirt. So this is the kind of stuff right here that just makes your site look a little bit more professional and a little bit more trustworthy, especially because people are buying stuff. They're like, oh, people are spending money here. So sales pop is free. Check that one out. Google Shopping. My Google Shopping account just got suspended. So when you get this one and you start adding stuff in there, make sure you know what you're doing. Because if you don't know what you're doing, when you start adding your stuff into Google Shopping, they're going to suspend your account because you can't have any errors. So if, any, if anything has errors or warning or anything like that, they're going to suspend your account. So hopefully this will get you started on your way. And, you know, it's pretty easy to navigate around the um, app store. So you can just come here, grow, um, you know, go to launch your shop. And in here will be almost everything that you need except for, like, you know, a few of the other ones I showed you earlier throughout the day. And, um, yeah, man, just go, go ahead and get out here and get this mess going and, and start trying stuff.